Hello, dear friends from C506. My name is Johan. Uh, welcome to another one of our unboxes. And today I'm having a really special one. I'm doing great. I hope you all are doing great as well. And welcome to C506. As you guys may know already, we are taking a look in Scarlow. This is the Mondo exclusive version. So let's hit the box. Just a little bit more of the information about the piece. Well, this is the, the limited edition and also it's an exclusive event piece. So I really want to say thank you so much to Mondo for sending this amazing figure to us. It's um, definitely an honor. And as you guys, people can see, he can actually glow in the dark. You know, like <laughs> glow in the darkness under the bed or, you know, something like that. I'm quite sure this box can glow too. And this is the, the box. This is the art in front. This time we don't have a, like a box that you can open like with other different, like with Keldor, but no, let's go directly to the figure, okay? This is how the blister of this figure looks, and this is the classic version. There is a different uh, piece from Scarlo by Mondo, but I really have to say this is my favorite. So let's go ahead and pull the base and let's see those accessories. Wow, and holy macaroni, this figure is looking amazing. Um, I have to say that this is some kind of new plastic that is being used by Mondo. And I don't know, you know, I, I really can't uh, tell you guys uh, like the difference. But, you know, with uh, a lot of Monsters of the Universe figures, um, you have like a sometimes a little soft plastic and you can feel that there is a little bit of leather and maybe sometimes it's not uh, really strong let's say um, the light plastic in my Batman for example but this has to be by far the strongest Masters of the Universe figure I've ever had and this helps a lot in posture and I know that he is going to look even better with the accessories. Just look at this. Huh? Pure classic. This is so beautiful. I'm like crazy to put all the items on him. So let's go ahead and take a look on different hands real quick. Okay, let's go with the swords. These are not uh, Skeletor's swords. These are definitely not Keldor's swords. These are new. Um, there is a beautiful wash here. And also, we can, we can notice the, the paint job and, and the sculpt here. I love extremely well-painted figures and this one is a piece full of details. Um, by far this is, you know, the, um, it's really personal, but um, this is my favorite figure in, in 2021, at least in this quarter of the year. Yeah, it's great. Um, I said the same about um, Keldor, but whoa, just, just look at this piece. He is amazing. Wow, and he's going to look even more aggressive with his partners in crime. So let's go ahead and continue with the items. I'm going to show six different uh, hands that you are going to find in the figure. So we have the claws, like, like if he's channeling a spell. Fist, 
Uh, this is the hand that can hold a sword or a tube. And another punch. So you can have him doing some kind of conjuration or, you know, like casting. You have the claws attacking and or relaxing maybe, it depends on you, and the fists. Now I'm going to put more accessories. And well, now I'm opening a little bit the, the camera because he is extremely huge. So I like a lot this kind of uh, stand. It's gonna be really well located. This is um, the stand is included. It's a beautiful stand by Mondo. Um, you can also put the, the swords here. And um, there is a piece of grassy stones that we need to add. So I'm going to do that right away. Let's move him just a little here. I love the chain and how the the cracks in the sculpt look. I'm going to just um, move the camera around a little bit with the figure, um, with all the accessories. And so let's do that. All right, friends, and all the people in C506 and Mondo followers, Masters of the Universe lovers, this is the amazing 1-6 scale Scarglow 2021. This is a very evil creature. And I love the effect. I mean, maybe he's uh, looking a little white in the camera but I mean he's like a little white with green in front of my eyes so maybe he looks different and that's like in the original figure because uh, clearly this is a tribute figure back to the old Masters of the Universe uh, age and I'm like crazy to find out how the glow is in the darkness, how powerful it is. And I'm going to do a couple of uh, shots tonight. So please, um, if you like our content, subscribe and leave a comment. Or you can show, show your piece as well in the night. Um, I'm checking on the highlights of the boots here. There are at least four different colors in those highlights. The retro, you know, the retro feeling is really good. You can see here the castle. This is the chain, the chain is amazing. Uh, the figure is extremely muscular. He's really big and tall. So yeah, he's a really, really bad, bad guy. And I'm extremely proud to be unboxing this figure for C506 from our friends in Mondo. You can put these swords uh, directly with him. Maybe you can put them on his back. Or you can even create a diorama with a different base and, you know, in the 1-6 scale, it is all up to you. But this piece is just whoa, really amazing. I'm extremely happy and I do hope that you guys uh, love this piece as well because it is amazing. I'm going to be posting pictures in our Facebook and also in YouTube. So please subscribe if you like our content, leave a commentary um, or like the video, please. And uh, you will be notified uh, about uh, those other pictures if you're interested in getting this piece. 
and we are going to see how it looks in the night but yes so far my favorite piece 2021 uh, Mondo is closing with this beautiful piece and wow I it's gonna be extremely happy next to all the the Mondo um, guys right over there so well thank you so much it's over 10 minutes so I'm leaving and well thank you so much people please have a wonderful weekend stay safe Goodbye.